For the fort in Alabog, see Kolaba Fort Kolaba or Kulaba is a part of the city of Mumbai, India, and also a Lok Sabha constituency. During Portuguese rule in the 16th century, the island was known as Kandal. After the British took over the island in the late 17th century, it was known as Kolio. Topic History The name Kalaba comes from Kolabat, a word in the language of Kolas, the indigenous inhabitants of the islands, before the arrival of the Portuguese. The area that is now Kalaba was originally a region consisting of two islands, Kalaba and Little Kalaba or Old Woman's Island. The island of Kalaba was one of the seven islands of Bombay ruled by the Portuguese. The Portuguese had acquired these lands from the Sultanate of Cambay by the Treaty of Bassein 1534. The group of islands was given by Portugal to Charles II of England as a dowry when he married Catherine of Braganza. The cession of Bombay and dependencies was strongly resented by Portuguese officials in Goa and Bombay, who resisted transfer of possession for several years, while the English representatives were confined to the island of Angediva while negotiations continued. Angered by the backtracking, Charles II leased these lands to the British East India Company for a nominal annual rent. Gerald Ongier, second governor of Bombay 1672, and the president of the English settlement of Surat, took possession of Calaba and Old Woman's Island on behalf of the company in 1675. Portugal continued to hold Little Calaba Island for several decades more before ceding it to the English in about 1762, subject to the retention of Portuguese ownership of a house on the island, that is now the Blessed Sacrament Chapel in Middle Calaba. This was leased by the Portuguese government of Goa to the Bishop of Damao, the head of the Pedrodo party in Bombay, as his residence. After an attempt by the Propaganda Fide Party to seize the chapel, a court ruled that the house remained the property of the government of Portugal and evicted the Propaganda Fide Party. In 1743, British Calaba was leased to Richard Broughton at Ars. 200 yearly, and the lease was renewed in 1764. By 1796, Calaba had become a cantonment. Calaba was known for the variety of fishes, the bumble Bombay duck, rawas, halwa, turtles, crabs, prawns and lobsters. A Calaba observatory, a meteorological observatory was established in 1826 in the part that was called Upper Calaba. The Calaba Causeway was completed in 1838, and thus, the remaining two islands were joined to the others. Gradually, Calaba became a commercial centre, after the Cotton Exchange was opened at Cotton Green in 1844. The real estate prices in the area went up. The Calaba Causeway was widened in 1861 and 1863. Calaba became a separate municipality ward in 1872. The Sikh bungalows now known as INHS Ashvini were built in the 19th century. The construction of the Anglican Church of St. John the Evangelist now known as Afghan Church after the First Afghan War of 1838 began in 1847. The church was consecrated in 1858, with the work on the steeple being concluded in 1865. The horse-drawn tram cars were introduced in 1873 by Stearns and Kitteredge, who had their offices on the west side of the causeway, where the electric house now stands. The Prongs Lighthouse was constructed at the southern tip of the island in 1875. The eponymous Sassoon docks were built by David Sassoon on reclaimed land in the same year. The BB and CI Railways established the Calaba Railway Station or Terminus, the site of which is now occupied by the Badwar Park layout. The development of Calaba pushed the native Colas to the edges of the island. The Bombay City Improvement Trust reclaimed around 90,000 square yards square meters on the western shore of Calaba. Eminent citizens of Mumbai, such as Sir Farazesha Mehta, opposed the work, fearing that the reclamation would depress prices of land. However, the reclamation work continued and was completed in 1905. There was no fall in the land prices. In 1906, a seafront road with a raised seaside promenade was completed, and named as Cuff Parade, after T. W. Cuff of the Trust. Topic present the Gateway of India, the Art Deco style Regal Theatre, the Cafés Café Mondiger, Café Royal and Leopold Café, and the Taj Mahal Palace and Tower, Royal Bombay Yacht Club, Badamiya Restaurant and Baghdadi Restaurant, as well as a number of modern pubs, restaurants and clubs all add to the atmosphere. The southern tip is occupied by a military cantonment, including the large Navy Nagar layout built on reclaimed land known as Holiday Camp. 
The older parts of the cantonment retains its large, wooded spaces and is the only bit of green left in this otherwise congested area. In the midst of Navy Nagar lies the Tata Institute of Fundamental Research one of India's leading scientific institutions. Kalaba is renowned for high-end boutiques and imitation consumer goods, and is popular with tourists. Notable residents include Ratan Tata, Anil Ambani, and Ravi Shastri. Kalaba Causeway, or just Causeway as it is known in Mumbai, offers everything from bracelets to perfumes to clothes to watches, clocks, DVDs and CDs. It has an old English charm and a very modern feel as well. Kalaba is also the art centre of Mumbai, with all the major galleries and museums located in and around this area. Kalaba is home to the Cooperage football ground. Nearest railway stations Church Gate, Chhatrapati Shivaji Terminus, CST, Victoria Terminus <laughs> Visitor attractions Kalaba Causeway, Kalaba Observatory, Kowashi Jehangir Hall, Ballard Estate, Cathedral of the Holy Name, Prongs Lighthouse, Gateway of India, Sassoon Docks, David Sassoon Library Gallery Topic terrorist attack in November 2008 On 26 November 2008, terrorist strikes occurred at various places in Kalaba, notably the Taj Mahal Palace and Tower, Leopold Café and Mumbai Habad House. The attacks resulted in over 100 deaths and significant damages. See also Kalaba Woods other business districts in and around Mumbai, Fort, Nariman Point, Vashi, CBD Belapur, Worli, Bandra Kurla Complex, Inderi, Lower Peril.